So you want to be a Christian influencer. There are three things you need. One, clothes. First of all, you need the clothes. You need the right threads. I have my signature green jacket. This gets me noticed, usually by social workers who want to know if I'm a homeless person. But nonetheless, when people see the green jacket, they know it's me. And they ask me questions like, do you get dressed in the dark? Do you have any other clothes? Does your wife know you're wearing this? Have you thought about maybe donating it to Goodwill? Stuff like that, but either way, you get noticed. You need a catchphrase. You need some kind of turn of phrase that people are gonna associate with you. And that's why I say, sweet mother of Melchizedek. Because people remember that, because it's about Melchizedek who didn't actually have a mother. Well, I mean, actually in Second Enoch, he does have a mother. Controversy. You know, you gotta mix it up. You gotta throw some oil into the fire. You gotta be so real that people cannot take it. You see, you gotta say it how it is and get noticed. Now, some will accuse you of being insensitive, arrogant, maybe being narcissistic, and they may not necessarily be wrong. But if you wanna become a Christian influencer, that's what you need. You need the clothes, you need the catchphrase, and you need the controversy.